Oh. Uh, Koof says, remember when no, Null called into the dick show? Pepperidge Farms remembers. Yeah, that was fun. And he it's got all bad. butthurt that uh, Digibro made fun of him. Yeah, it's it's funny. I've I found out where I went wrong with Null. Mm. I've pinpointed the moment. Would you? Who did you not hate? It's better than that. You know how Null loves black people, right? <laughs> yeah. There's this weirdo chick on the farms, uh, Melinda Scott. She was the Jewish magicianess, the Mountain Jew. Okay. She did like Jewish Kabbalic magic or whatever. And she like to make her uterus work. And she has like a ton of children with all these different dudes. Her ex sort of husband or boyfriend, Marshall, he had like challenged me to a fight because that's what, um, that's what hilarious yeah. people do. Yeah. Uh, he's dead now. He died. Oh. But while he was alive. You kill him? No, 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 no. I think he killed himself, which is sad. Oh. But uh, I found this out just randomly. Um, while he was alive, I had Drexel on the show. Okay. Here's a picture of her. It's from my thumbnail. <laughs> the easiest one. Uh, here we go. I'll, I'll pull it up for the chat to see too. Are you serious? Wait, that's Marshall? Yeah, this is Marshall. Stop! Yeah, that's him. Th that's the <laughs> badass. Yeah, doesn't he look like a badass? <laughs> roast him roast him make fun of his looks that'd be funny well, what's there to say uh she <laughs> clearly wears the pants the shirt <laughs> the penis whether plastic or otherwise she has an enlarged clit that he, she pegs him with look at those soft fucking soy cutlet eyes <laughs> you see this bitch made fucking simp mangina <laughs> Yeah, okay. Look. Yeah, stop you. That's not him. <laughs> oh, <it's> not <laughs> That's Josh, the owner of Kiwi Farms. I photoshopped his face in over her boyfriend. <laughs> Wait, and we had Josh on the show? Yep. Oh, Josh. <laughs> you got wrecked. <laughs> Josh. Everything I said is still true. <laughs> Fuck you. Look, those eyes are soft. And Drexel was talking about, he think he had talked about the previous time on the show that he would be asked to do cuck shaming to like, uh, when he was with these guys, wives, the wives oh, would make him yeah, make fun of the husbands. Like that. Yeah. Well, so I, I asked Drex if he would cuck shame Marshall, who was this Melinda Scott's boyfriend or husband or whatever. And he said, sure, bring up a picture of him. So I brought up a picture, but I had Photoshopped Null's face onto this guy's picture. And so Drexel Dude, he there. doesn't like getting made fun of. That's what Digi Digibro's making fun of him too, and he fucking melted down. He's it been was... seething. He seethes about this shit for years. Dude, it was the funniest thing because like Drex felt really bad about it because I was like, Drex, that's a, that's actually he was going hard too. And I was like, that's not actually Marshall. That's that's Josh. That's Josh yeah. Moon. I was just making. I was doing a joke. Oh, I was a God. bit. He's like, Drex's like, oh, I'm sorry, man. That's cold. Like. He, he felt bad about it. And it's like, he just made fun of Josh that he had soft eyes and like a pancake face or whatever. And <laughs> it was the funniest fucking thing. But I think that's where, that's where it all went downhill. Yeah, it was yeah. after you that. If you make fun of him, you're, you're dead. He's he like that billions seeds. must die guy, but fat. He just sits there and it's like, it eats away at him endlessly in the back yeah. of his mind. And then he starts framing you negatively. It's, it's so fucking funny because you could go back and trace the downfall of my relationship with Null to that joke. And I was like, that was a funny joke. Oh, man. <laughs> mm. Okay, here we go. Um, Yaroslav Blaschuk says, love what you do, Nose. Need help to lose 30 pounds. Shame me. It just works. Oh, you need help to lose 30 pounds? You need help? Why don't you try just crippling depression so you don't fucking eat anymore? Just stay in bed for a while. Let all that fat seep out in your bed sheets like you already do. Just don't squeeze them into a bowl and use it to cook your eggs in the morning. You disgusting slob. I hate fat people. Yeah, if you're going to get out of bed, be skinny. Otherwise, stay in it. Was it the line from American Psycho? You can always be thinner. Yeah. 
Thank you for watching this clip by Colonel J. This is the King of Bold here. Remember to like and subscribe. Juice!